Hello and welcome to our video on 10 American grocery stores that will be gone by 2024. As the world changes and technology evolves, many traditional grocery stores are finding it difficult to keep up with the times. In this video, we'll be looking at 10 American grocery stores that may not be around in the near future. But before we start, please subscribe to our channel so we can keep making content like this. Let's get started. 1. Lucky's Market Lucky's Market was a grocery store chain that specialized in natural and organic foods. Unfortunately, in 2020, the company filed for bankruptcy and was forced to close most of its stores. 2. Earth Fair Earth Fair was another organic grocery chain that struggled to compete with larger retailers. In 2020, the company filed for bankruptcy and closed all of its stores. 3. Fresh Market Fresh Market is a specialty grocery store that focuses on high-end and gourmet foods. However, due to increased competition and changing consumer preferences, the chain has struggled in recent years. 4. Fairway Market Fairway Market is a New York-based grocery store chain that has been in business for over 80 years. Unfortunately, in 2020, the company filed for bankruptcy and closed most of its stores. 5. Southeastern Grocers Southeastern Grocers is the parent company of several grocery store chains, including Winn-Dixie and Bilo. However, the company has struggled with debt and declining sales in recent years, which may lead to store closures in the future. 6. Tops Markets Tops Markets is a grocery store chain that operates in New York, Pennsylvania, and Vermont. The company has faced financial difficulties in recent years and may be forced to close some of its stores. 7. Save-A-Lot Save-A-Lot is a discount grocery store chain that operates over 1,000 stores in the United States. The company has faced stiff competition from larger retailers, which may lead to store closures in the future. 8. Albertsons Albertsons is a large grocery store chain that operates over 2,200 stores in the United States. The company has been facing increased competition from online retailers such as Amazon and Walmart, but it has also been investing heavily in e-commerce and home delivery services to keep up with changing consumer preferences. While it may face some challenges in the future, it is unlikely that Albertsons will be forced to close any of its stores in the near future. 9. Kroger Kroger is another large grocery store chain that operates over 2,700 stores in the United States. While the company has been successful in recent years, increased competition and changing consumer preferences may lead to store closures in the future. 10. Walmart is the largest retailer in the world, with over 4,700 stores in the United States alone. The company has been successful in recent years, but is facing increased competition from online retailers and changing consumer preferences. To address these challenges, Walmart has been investing heavily in e-commerce and home delivery and has also been experimenting with new store formats such as smaller, convenience-style stores. Walmart has also been expanding its product offerings to include more organic and natural foods as well as making commitments to sustainability and reducing waste. While it faces some challenges, Walmart's size and resources put it in a relatively strong position in the grocery industry, and it is unlikely that the company will be forced to close any of its stores in the near future. The grocery industry is facing a period of rapid change, with increased competition, changing consumer preferences, and the rise of online shopping all putting pressure on traditional brick and mortar stores. While some smaller grocery chains like Lucky's Market, Earth Fair, and Fairway Market have struggled and may not survive beyond 2024, larger chains like Albertsons, Kroger, and Walmart are likely to weather the storm due to their size, resources, and investments in e-commerce and home delivery services. It remains to be seen how the grocery industry will continue to evolve in the coming years, but it is clear that stores that are able to adapt to changing consumer preferences and offer a seamless online and in-person shopping experience will be the most successful. Whether you prefer to shop in-store or online, the grocery stores of tomorrow will need to offer the convenience, quality, and value that today's consumers demand. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.